Tonight's story is The Magic Paintbrush. Once upon a time in a small, quiet village, there lived a young artist named Lily. Lily loved to draw and paint, spending hours each day creating beautiful pictures of animals, landscapes, and imaginary creatures. Her favorite place to paint was under the big oak tree in her backyard, where she felt most inspired. One sunny afternoon, while Lily was painting a picture of a vibrant garden filled with flowers and butterflies, she noticed something glimmering in the grass. Curiously, she picked it up and found it was a paintbrush with a golden handle and bristles that sparkled in the sunlight. Excited by her discovery, Lily decided to use the new brush to finish her painting. As she painted, something magical happened. The flowers she painted began to bloom and sway in the breeze, and the butterflies fluttered off the paper and into the air. Lily gasped in amazement as her drawings came to life before her eyes. She quickly realized that the paintbrush she had found was no ordinary brush. It was a magic paintbrush that brought her art to life. Over the next few days, Lily used the magic paintbrush to create a world filled with friendly creatures and colorful landscapes. She painted a gentle deer who nuzzled her hand, a playful puppy that chased its tail, and a beautiful rainbow that stretched across the sky. The village was soon abuzz with excitement as Lily's magical creations filled the streets, bringing joy and wonder to everyone. However, not everyone in the village was happy about Lily's newfound power. A mischievous character named Max, who was always looking for ways to cause trouble, saw the magic paintbrush as an opportunity to gain power and control. He devised a plan to steal the brush from Lily. One evening, as the sun was setting and Lily was finishing a painting of a sparkling river, Max snuck into her yard and snatched the paintbrush. Lily was heartbroken when she discovered it was gone. She knew she had to get it back before Max could use it for mischief. With determination in her heart, Lily set off to find Max. She followed a trail of footprints that led her to the village square, where she saw Max using the paintbrush to create chaos. He painted fierce dragons and mischievous imps that scared the villagers and caused havoc. Lily knew she had to act quickly. She picked up a plain old paintbrush and dipped it into her paints, hoping that her love for art would be enough to make a difference. She painted a brave knight and a wise owl who came to life and helped her confront Max. Stop, Max, Lily called out. You can't use the magic paintbrush for harm. It was meant to bring joy and beauty into the world. Max scoffed, but the knight and owl stood by Lily's side, ready to protect her. Seeing the courage in Lily's eyes, Max hesitated. He realized that his mischief had caused more harm than good, and that the true magic lay in the love and care with which Lily created her art. Reluctantly, Max handed the magic paintbrush back to Lily. She smiled and thanked him, promising to use the brush wisely. With a few strokes, Lily painted away the chaos and restored peace to the village. From that day on, Lily continued to use the magic paintbrush to bring happiness and wonder to her friends and family. She understood the importance of using her gift responsibly and always painted with love and kindness in her heart. And so, the village of Willowbrook was filled with colorful landscapes, friendly creatures, and the joyful creations of Lily, the young artist with the magic paintbrush and they all lived happily ever after. <laughs>